Chase Tedonio with us here in the John Mandola Show, the Riverside quarterback, now a baseball player. So uh, <laughs> let's talk about that transition from football season over to baseball season. There's things I'm sure you're still doing from football, working out, lifting, doing all that stuff, but then you got to kind of switch gears to baseball. Uh, easy for you, just two sports that you really enjoy? Yeah, I mean, you know, I always enjoy playing baseball and football. We have a really good schedule in the offseason for baseball to get us kind of into that mode to get going in March. We go uh, January, February, we go hard at it. And uh, it really helps with the transition from football to baseball. Let's talk about you. You always have a poker face when I talk to you. You know, you're, you're, you're very focused, you know. Talk a little bit about, you know, where that comes from, that work ethic that, you know, hey, I'm going to work and I'm, I'm gonna be serious about football now, I'm gonna be serious about baseball. Yeah, I guess I kind of get that from my dad a lot. Uh, he kind of taught me to always go at everything with uh, my most best effort. 100% with everything, and uh, that's kind of what I take to the field and to pretty much everything I do in life, you know, all the time just going at it. Athleticism, you know, it, it's funny, you know, we see some of these NFL guys like, wait, that guy's a quarterback the way he throws a baseball? We've seen that recently. <laughs> but let's talk about your athleticism and how you feel it goes over from being a quarterback to now being a baseball player. Yeah, I mean, I feel like, you know, throwing – all different kind of all different kinds of arm angles with baseball helps translates to football. Same thing with football to baseball. Everything kind of you know goes hand in hand with each other. Um, I definitely think that the athleticism aspect of it is good for both sports because it really helps when you're in a situation. You know, baseball can help with football. Football can help with baseball. Uh, it just kind of goes hand in hand with each other. Let's talk about the academics for you and you know, staying after it and making sure you're doing your job at your junior year. It's a big year for you. You're trying to still impress to make that step for next year as to what you may want to do for your future. I mean, yeah, you know, academics is always the most important thing. You're a student athlete first. Um, you know, I always make sure after practice, after long practices, you know, get, get home, get the schoolwork done, and everything else comes, kind of comes after that. You, know? you talk about Coach Hughes, talk about his approach and, and, you know, what you like about his style as a coach. Yeah, I mean, you know, this is my third year under Coach Hughes. Um, you know, we've really grown to kind of – Separate from being my coach, just kind of being a friend to me. You know, it's he's always kind of the guy. And if I need, if I have something going on, I can go to him. And yeah, he's always someone I'm good to talk to. So yeah, he's overall a great guy. What do you like about this team? I mean, you guys just keep winning, but you know, there's got to be things you like. Like, is it that you guys you're down and you find a way to win, or you're up and you maintain the win? What what yeah, is it? I mean, this team feels different from the previous two years, just because you know we lost the start of our season. As everybody knows, we lost the Player of the Year, and uh, we lost probably the the Jimmy Decker hit leader last year in the District 2, so coming off two big losses there. And somehow, you know, that pool of freshmen that we got, these sophomores that were playing on JV last year all came up, and some of these kids are batting 400, you know, so they're really contributing to this team a lot, and they're really giving us something special this year. All right. Well, it's good to catch up with you again, and, uh, hey, we'll, uh, we'll hopefully talk to you during football season as well. Of course.